everybody in here just sitting here having some iced coffee today and today is the day that I'm going to fire up that rocket stove so I need to do some things first I need to get the welder's blanket underneath of it I need to get the sheet metal behind it um, and I am just so tired right now you guys can probably tell because I was up that last night just overthinking everything <laughs> you know overthinking everything and um, I was watching videos, I was reading, looking at photos, just to make sure that I'm on target with what I'm doing. So we're going to light this baby up. <sighs> Wish me luck. It is officially fired up, and there is a fire in there. I'm not going to open this up because smoke comes out. <laughs> it comes out. I've got both of the vents all the way open, and I've got this behind here. Made some modifications to that. Let's see if we've got smoke coming out there. I don't know. I'm going to have to go outside and see. It absolutely is working. I don't know if you can see up there, but there's holes in the side of it and the top is covered. So I think that's all I'm going to need for right now, but I'm not seeing smoke coming out of anywhere at all except for that top pipe. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful, you guys? Right at the top. Woohoo! Well, it is going pretty good inside there. And even when I keep the door open just this little bit, uh, I mean, I'm not getting any smoke. I'm seeing dust, but, well, maybe a tiny bit of smoke, yeah. But not enough to make the smoke alarm go off, so. And this is giving me, oh my goodness. Yes, indeed. Plenty, plenty of heat. Let me just close this a little bit. And so that I can kind of feel what it feels like. Yep, I can feel the heat coming off of this pipe. Oh, man, this is going to be so good. Uh, I didn't think I had to put that there. I know I said I wasn't going to put the foil tape against anything that was going to get hot. But I think this is. I think it'll be okay. I'm just going to watch it. Um, I don't think the foil catches on fire. I think it's the actual adhesive. So, I don't know. I'm just going to have to keep an eye on it. Kind of sealed that off a little bit better. And yes, ma'am, let's see if this is hot. Nope. Nope. It's warm, but it's not super hot. Let me feel behind here. This, it's not even warm at all. Behind the, the welder's mat is not hot at all. Yep, that's warm. Welder's blanket is cool. So, yeah, um, I don't think I really need this much. I'm going to have to make some adjustments with this welder's blanket. I do like it. I think I want it to come out just a little bit further. And it's working, you guys. It is working. I can't believe it. I'm kind of tired today, so I'm not going to make a long video. But this, oh, yes. Oh, man, this is going to heat this place up. Oh, my goodness. Oh, and check this out. My harvesting basket. This is what I'm going to use to harvest, I mean, to pick up wood in the wintertime because I won't be harvesting any plants probably. And this is the perfect size. If the logs can fit into there lengthwise, then they're the right size for the stove. So this is perfect. This is what I'm going to get my wood gathered up in and just burn this thing like crazy. <sighs> I did wipe it down, believe it or not, but you know what? These things kind of burn and get gross. Um, I had already pre... I, I seasoned this already. I've already uh, cooked on it a couple times outdoors. They tell you to do that. So everything has been cured already. And... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This puts out so much heat, you guys. No smoke alarm yet, which is good. And it's still going. I got the door cracked just to give it a little bit of oxygen. And I haven't put hardly any wood in there. I just put little pieces. I didn't, maybe one piece that's that size. Everything else is just little. And it is burning great. <laughs> I got some fire bricks in there. I need, I think I need a couple more just uh, to kind of cut down. I don't know. I may just leave it just like that. Uh, I might just leave it just like that. That's fine. Got them in the sides. Got them in the back. So it's going, and it's working, 
yeah, once this cools down, I'm going to scrub it down a lot better. I did kind of dust it off a little bit, but I want it to look nice in here. Oh, Lord have mercy. Mmm, it smells good. Um, it doesn't, I mean, it's not an overwhelming smell of smoke or anything like that. And like I said, my smoke detector, which is over there, <laughs> is, uh, sorry that I panned so quickly, but it's on and it has not gone off yet. So, we're doing good, guys. I think this is going to work just fine. I'm not going to burn this for very long today because, well, it's hot. It's it, I don't need to burn it long today. Just going to do a quick fire and see how it, how it goes and how hot things get. I'm going to go outside and feel those pipes outside too, see how hot they are. All I know is I would not be able to touch these pipes because you can feel the heat radiating off of them. And it's going in, there's no smoke coming out of here, no smoke coming out of here, no smoke at all. And it seems like this, this is holding up. Yep, I can still touch it. Yep, I can even touch it behind here. And it's not too hot. Oh, my goodness, this is awesome. The fire has been out for, I don't know, I, I would say about 10 minutes now. And... I'm still feeling heat coming off of all of this. There, it's just really, really warm. Not hot, warm, and because I've got those fire bricks in there, I just can't believe it. I'm so happy, I'm so relieved. I was so worried about this, guys. I wasn't sure if it's gonna work, but the fire, fire's been out and it's still warm, it's still putting off heat. <sighs> it worked. It worked, and it didn't set anything on fire. Of course, I did a short burn, so the longer burns, I'm still going to be very, very mindful. <sighs> I am just so very happy that this has all come together. It's going to keep me warm, and it's just going to keep me company. I love to watch. Well, I won't really be able to watch a fire um, because I, I won't be able to keep the thing open, but... Just having that stove in there, it just makes the cabin so much more cozy. And it's going to be warm. It's going to be warm during the winter. So this is going to be a short one, guys. Um, I did want to just show you one picture that uh, the hoodie took yesterday of one of the hens. You're going to crack up. Just look at her. I can't believe it. She just decided to plop herself right down on top of my chamomile. They've mostly eaten it, which that's okay. Like I said yesterday, it uh, doesn't bother me. The herbs are at their kind of tail end of the season anyhow, so it's okay if they eat them. But, yeah, she just looks like she's kind of nesting there right on top of the chamomile, kind of like she wants to lay eggs. I don't know. Maybe eggs are coming soon. I think I got another month, an, a month at least. But I thought you guys would get a kick out of that. Isn't she cute? Look at that. That is just perfect. Perfect. That's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.